Hey guys and welcome to another Brit Bros tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make an anti-missile system for vaults. Now there's two ways to do this, one with an anti-ballistic missile and one with a uh, EMP thing. Uh, well I'll show you the uh, anti-ballistic first and don't worry this is just a missile I'm going to fire the test at the end. Now what you want to, go to do for first is get an air radar uh, and power it. You can use any power source you like. I'm using an infinite battery in a battery box. You can use solar panel or whatever you whatever you want. Now that's set up, I'm just gonna double this up and make it a hundred and two hundred. And there we go. Now now I'm gonna sh get the anti ballistic things. I want that and that. And that, and uh, pull out these. Using a tier three system here, you set it up as a, you normally would, <coughs> and just using this uh, support just uh, for that extra stability. Now power this again. I'm going to use the infinite battery. Once again, you can use any power source you like. I'll just all just put that down and connect the red because this will emit a resistant pulse when a missile is in its boundaries and then that will fire the missile. So that's that done. Now let's get a EMP tower. This uh, EMP tower is a much more compact version. I, I use this myself. I don't don't like the uh, anti blister because sometimes it can hit the walls if you're underground or something and it's just this is much more smaller and compact and it it just uses a little more power and a bit more difficult to make but you don't have to reload it you just just have to have uh, the power power will spin it up again with this you have to build a whole new missile which can be clum clumsy and just uh, annoying because this will this will work even when you're not there So again, put the redstone pulse, and uh, yeah, that's all you need. Follow. Uh, oh, I forgot to put the infinite battery in there. Sorry, but yep, that's all you need. This is two ways to do it. Only, only two ways I know of, anyway. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna now show you a test. So see you in a sec. All right, guys, uh, welcome back. One thing I'd like to add is this says target too close, so it will not fire. You have to change this to uh, something that's just far away, like just take away the numbers. And that means it'll fire properly. Now this should all be in place. Um, just gotta get rid of this piece of redstone. Fingers crossed this works. Off we go. There we go. Uh, and I'll just reload this. And uh, we'll try the EMP cannon now. Make sure this is set to missile. Uh, let's make this a hundred block radius. Yeah, the more radius you, you could put as much radius as you like, I think. And uh, then it just needs more energy. That's why I like it. Let's try this. And with this, it'll actually drop the missile out the uh, sky. I don't know if you just saw that drop, but uh, then so you can actually steal their missiles with this. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe if you found this uh, helpful, and any comments would be appreciated. Thanks and goodbye.